So what's today? Today is Sunday. And what is also today? Today is also April 28th. Is it 28th or 27th? 27th. But also today is? Our very first Foodie, Foodie adventure, adventure Day. day. You're supposed to say it with me. God damn it, baby cakes. Today is our first <laughs> day. No, 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 no. Stop. Oh my God. Are you going to drop me? <laughs> ago we started an instagram account a foodie instagram account and you know we thought we basically like to eat and we eat <laughs> we basically uh, like to eat we like to try out new places to eat <laughs> we basically we basically we eat food we basically we, are humans who need yeah, food basically that's something that's in our lives so we decided we're wasting all this money trying all these places and taking all these pictures so we might as well let you know what our favorite what our favorite spots are the price range, the location, the rating that we give them. So today we're gonna take you to my personal favorite breakfast place. We're going to snooze. We're going to snooze. We're going to snooze. Ah! Snooze is about pancakes. I don't know what they put in those pancakes, but it almost feels like they're gourmet specialty pancakes. It's not your regular IHOP pancakes. Each pancake is different. I mean, yeah, it's a batter pancake, but they have different toppings. So like I usually get the blueberry danish and then the pineapple upside down pancake. They also have a pancake of the day. So if you're looking into getting the pancakes, just ask them what's the pancake of the day. All pancakes are good. You can go wrong with them. What I recommend is get the three pancakes, tell them it's your birthday, get an extra pancake, and then treat yourself to some French toast. Ooh, the OMG French toast. OMG French it's toast. It's something you need to try when you're as new as yeah. OMG French toast. And why are they called OMG French toast? Yeah. I'll tell you why. <laughs> tell because me why. Because it's OMG. When you try them and you put them in your mouth, it's just like, that's literally what you say. Oh my God, it's so good. If you come to at the bar. Thank you for taking that from me. Uh. <laughs> tip. Uh, if you come here and there's like a two hour wait, which mo most likely will be because this is a great brunch breakfast place. An hour 45 to two hours. If there you see any open seats at the bar, try to take them. Because you can literally have like 25 people in front of you and you can just be like, uh-huh, honey, I'm going to sit at the bar. Yeah. Yeah, so that's what we're going to try to do. We're going to try to see if we can go stand in the back of some people to make them stand up and we can take their seats. Treat yourself to a cup of joe while you wait. Obviously, these games are rigged, but go ahead, try them. Loser oh. pays a bill. If you have a cover, and he likes pancakes too. If you have a what? A pupper? A pupper? <laughs> if you have a pupper. A puppers are welcome here at Snooze. We were waiting in there. We saw the pancake of the day is banana bread pancake. So I'm definitely gonna try that one because I love banana bread. And I love pancakes. So you can't go wrong with that. We always got this spot. Snooze has locations in Colorado, California, Arizona, and Texas. If you're a pancake lover, you should definitely give Pancake Flight a try. No energy. What makes Snooze a great brunch place? Probably that it has a full bar and a great selection of shots, shots, shot, 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 shots. I decided to go with the straight up Bloody Mary. 
they hook it up with the boots. Yeah. You like that? There's string selections for everyone, even if you're into bacon and eggs in a cup. The last, the last of it. For those health craze people, Snooze has a place for you. You can find the healthy selections in Like the Feather Mint. Trust me, everything in there is delicious. Try the avocado toast. The moment has come where we have to rate you, Snooze. Do you get the infamous five spoons? Or do you get zero spoons? Without further ado, you snooze will be four spoons. The reason why is ain't nobody got time to wait two hours for a pan cake. Final thought, snooze has an overall friendly staff. Great music. They hook it up with the drinks. Snooze okay. will fill you up and it'll leave you talking about how great it is. Oh, there you go. For two people, two dishes, and an alcoholic beverage, we spend around 40 bucks. So it's not so bad for a special breakfast or brunch with the ladies or with your special someone, we recommend you try this spot. Until next time, please subscribe. I'm about to get the face reaction. Yeah. So good.